Hello and welcome to another special video review and today we've got the evil voice destruction <laughs> from APC Toys. So yeah, this is uh, APC Toys version of Soundwave from the movie, uh, from the series, TV series, uh, Prime, uh, Transformer Prime. So yeah, uh, I am a big fan of Soundwave, so of course I had to pick it. Even though I have the original one, I had to do uh, <laughs> check that one out. So yeah, we have the box right here. Uh, nothing too spectacular. I guess this is legal stuff. Uh, and we don't even have screenshots of the uh, the figure itself. So, transforming fighter with two modes and full action. Uh. <laughs> so yeah, just box. So yeah, let's open it up. See what's inside. Uh, oops, that way, I guess. And instructions are done. All right. So first up, instructions, so the transformation is pretty identical as the original one. So yeah, this is uh, Soundwave from Prime, transformation identical. There's nothing really changed about the figure, beside a bigger, pa uh, better paint, uh, color, and a little bit of size. He's not that taller, but he is a little bit, so the rest is pretty identical. So yeah, so yeah, instructions pretty easy, and yeah. Uh, we do have some extra accessories, so yeah, we have sort of like a, a backplate and tentacles, kind of like in this series if you've watched uh, the Transformer Prime, he has sort of tentacles, so these are like uh, wires and they can bend however we want, we can install the claws like this and put some more claws in like this, we can put, oops, some more here. There you go. I think you falling off my table. But yeah, we have like these sort of tentacles. And we can put some more here. Like this. We have like the hole and we have like these that are sort of like half holes. Half pigs, I guess. Yeah, like this. And then another one here. There you go. So we have tentacles. And they plug onto this plate. Like this. Like this. And this will eventually plug in the back of the figure. So we have like this. So it's kind of cool. This is an extra accessory that the original didn't have. So yeah. And we have the figure right here. So yeah, let's take it out. Point. You gotta be careful because the, there's a lot of spikes and it just keeps grab on to the foam. But yeah, we have Soundwave right here. Now, of course, you can see he's not uh, well transformed. So you have to pull this up and pull this down and pull the feet down. So again, this up and down. This down, this down. And we have to open the arms like this like this and we have sound wave transform and ready so yeah it's yeah, pretty cool uh nice paint and everything let's move the camera a little bit up so we can see even better but yeah he is pretty damn cool the he is full plastic the original one had some sort of rubbery soft plastic uh quality to it this one is just like full on uh, hard plastic he's got tons of uh, details like those purple lines on the wings on the chest he has the visor that is painted so looks really cool <clears throat> again this is all rubbery ish on the original one this one is all hard plastic so yeah very, very cool and oops <laughs> we have in here the butt plug where we plug the back plate and we have his tentacles so yeah really cool <laughs> and the original one is right here and you can see there's not a lot of difference in height so he's a little bit smaller so I'd say this is more deluxe this is more Voyager size that's uh, the best I can sum it <laughs> uh, this one also has the toy hacks uh, stickers so he's just a bit more detail than the uh, the original was but uh, yeah it's mostly just chest and face uh, that has the uh, stickers all the rest uh, the other one it comes like this so yeah 
you can see right here in the back. Like I said, pretty much everything else is identical. So just more details and just taller. That's it. <laughs> uh, we can do a better comparison with the other ones maybe. Uh, we have the other APC RC. Uh, we have APC Nemesis Prime. And we have APC Megatron. So, woo. <laughs> we have the whole family of APC. That's pretty much all they, they put out on moles. Uh, there's more coming up. There's rumor of Bulkhead coming up. So, yeah, can't wait for that one. See which one's gonna take. If it's gonna be like the first edition or the other one. I think there's gonna be like a, uh, what do you call it, a clue jumper also. We'll see. I haven't seen anything yet so far. So, yeah, figure itself. Really cool. The head is on sort of a swivel ball joint so it can move back and forth. He uh, can rotate, but it's sort of like side to side. It doesn't move too much. Uh, oh, yeah, okay. We'll remove the tentacles. <laughs> Arms are on a swivel like this, on a other swivel like this. There's a elbow bend here, another elbow bend here, uh, swivel at the elbow. Uh, I guess we have this, <laughs> which, yeah, we have rotation here, we have ab crunch, but the ab uh, on mine is loose. That's the only thing that I don't like about this figure, the ab crunch is loose. So I guess I can fix it, but yeah. Kind of like RC had really loose, whoops, very loose legs. Uh, mine has a really loose uh, waist. The rest is okay. I mean, uh, the legs I can do the split, uh, not far. Like like this is pretty much all. Uh, leg can go forward, uh, backward. We do have rotation at the upper thigh, and he has like super tiny thighs with a huge leg. <laughs> we do have a sort of a, a double joint knee. But it only goes forward, uh, backward a little bit. Not much. Articulation on the legs is not that great. Uh, we have this knee pad, I guess, right here. Uh, he's supposed to have like more chicken legs, like this. But uh, that kind of hinders. I don't like the uh, heels. They are, they're supposed to go up like this, but it makes them look bigger, I guess. <laughs> the original one had like a better placement where the uh, the whole leg would go down. What's that? Nah. So yeah, the, the original one had better leg placement, like this. This one doesn't really wheel. Well, okay, we have to force it a little bit. So yeah, okay, it looks better like this. But you have to force it through a pin. So maybe it's like that. It's supposed to hold. No, because it does look way better like this. So yeah, as for the eel spur. Uh, not that good. At least they hold, but it's not like, you know, they, they kind of go like this, like this. Uh, bigger itself needs to move uh, kind of weirdly, but... Uh, <laughs> yeah, but the figure itself is pretty cool. We do have laser beak hidden in the chest, so let's move it here. So we have laser beak, and we can transform it sort of like this. And laser beak has nice details. Really cool laser purple thingy on the wings so yeah just I just wish we had details for the face and the original one oh, let's bring it here oh. original one had like soft rubber uh, wings this one is all full plastic so yeah and there's not a lot of details on the original one so yeah still pretty cool yeah wish we had like the other ones because he has like a, uh, a version where it comes with Ravage. Would have been nice to have that. So, yoink, yoink. Really cool figure. <laughs> uh, articulation, just, that's the only way he can do like transformation now. Like I said, transformation pretty much like the original. Uh, just uh, exactly the same <laughs> in fact. So take the arms, pin them here like this. Close the hand in like this. So the other arm, you can see there's a pin here at the upper elbow. So you just bring it here, clip it in, 
and then you clip this in like this. Next up, you want to bring the wings. Yep. Well, the wings like this. So we bring it like this and clip it in. And then you want to bring the arms down like this. Arms down like this. Take the backpack, open it up. Open the uh, thruster, I guess. Open this up and bring the head inside like this. Close the backpack. There you go. You know, uh, the feet now, you close the feet in like this. Close the feet in like this. Straighten up the legs. And yeah, they will sort of a tab like this. So bring it here. Bring it down. Bring this down, down. And then the front cockpit here. Foot cockpit here and with the foot here like this and then you can peg the legs together like this peg here peg in the middle peg at the front peg at the heel spurs and then close it in make sure this goes here and then finally the legs oops, this is some pegged oop come back here this and why did everything just pegged off all right like this and now you peg the legs here there this is like the big peg right here was stuck inside the thighs there you go one and do the other one there you go so we have uh, the um, throne mode of Soundwave, <laughs> and it's really cool I love the transformation it's simple elegant works you can still use the uh, butt plate thing here and give him like the the big uh, the, the tentacle thing <laughs> kind of looks goofy on a drone but uh, I guess it works <laughs> but yeah uh, still really nice plane uh, we don't have a lot of details uh, besides the original one for the robot so that's cool we do have a landing gear here so we can just lift this up but we don't have any landing gear anywhere else so just have a wheel in front so that's it <laughs> it kind of wobbles but yeah that's pretty much it he is pretty cool uh like i said i love the drum mode it's a nice uh nice look for a sound wave it totally is representative so yeah i'm just gonna do a quick comparison with him and his buddies so here we have uh, APCs and the original one so you can see the size difference so well, that's pretty much it the, the plastic details and the size different the rest is identical so not really uh, worth it if you have the original one but it's still cool to have like a different size and better plastic I guess but yeah original one pretty identical it's pretty much same details uh, has a little bit more details in fact on the cockpit with the black bar here, here there's nothing. Uh, underneath we have the blue under the wing. This one has nothing. Uh, this one do have some detail on the shoulder. This one doesn't have, which but mine has because it's toy hacks. But uh, yeah, the back uh, thruster is chrome. The other one's just plastic blue. But uh, yeah. And uh, can we? Uh, let's just try. Just curious. But is it the same peg? Yeah, the same peg. So we even in robot mode, we can share the tentacle thingy. In robot mode, it's the same peg. So <laughs> yeah. And just for another comparison, here's the APC Megatron. So yeah, of course this is just a giant <laughs> leader size spacecraft. All this in is a uh, drone. But uh, yeah. All right, that's that's it. I'm not gonna compare the Nemesis and the RC since they are. Uh, uh, a bike and a truck so they uh they, they really don't compare to the uh, to a drone but yeah still cool but uh, yeah apc sound wave which is well evil voice destruction weird uh a cool figure uh just uh way the looseness of the the waist i'm not sure if it's uh, gonna be just miming or it's uh um, the thing that it's uh, everyone will have uh cool color nice plastic 
transformation identical. So like I said, if you have the original one, it's not really worth upgrading to this one. But if you don't have the original one, yeah, go and pick it up. It's really cool. Uh, it's Soundwave, so of course I got I had to pick it up. But yeah, I'm I have the original one. And I'm quite happy with it. Uh, of course, there's like good and bad on both, but um, yeah, it's still a really nice uh, version for uh, Soundwave right here. So yeah, if you don't have the original one, go and pick it up. I highly recommend it. Otherwise, uh it's not worth uh, upgrading they're pretty pretty this pretty much the same it's just this one is a tad bigger which i i don't know it might fit a lot more with uh, the figures uh apc has been uh, has brought out but yeah yeah a little bit more in scale I, i'd say but in you know, the original one still holds pretty good so yeah i got this from seertoys.com i'm gonna put the link in the description below the video if you want to have it it's cheap it's good go and get it uh like i said the link in the description below to seertoys.com great place for uh your uh daily knockoffs <laughs> so yeah uh, you know the song like subscribe leave a comment and i thank you for watching and i'll see you next time <laughs>